For me, I wanted that feeling I had when I was a kid, running out onto a field, rain, hail and little shine, um, to get that, you know, that, that buzz from being involved with rugby. And although I'm refereeing, it's the next best, it's the next best option, option. You've got the best seat in the house. I get um, involved in a community that is born out of rugby. I'm not expecting to be the next Glenn Jackson or Craig Schubert, but I want to have fun. I want to be a part of this still con a strong community of rugby and at the same time do the best that I can for them. I always wanted to be a rugby referee. Um, I just saw people in the middle, I was like, well, I want to be just like them. I thought I'd uh, switch sides of the whistle and get into refereeing and gave it a go for a couple of games with the kids on Saturday morning, just totally hooked and just loved it. So I thought, let's, let's throw in the game and let's go for it and keep helping the community. The next day, he said, oh, well, we've got a meeting on Monday night. Do you want to come along to it? Yeah, let's bring a mate. I said to him, yeah, let's give it a go. And off we went and, yeah, here I am. Six years later. <laughs> Studying full time and working, I don't have a lot of time to commit to trainings, but I can always have some free time on a Saturday, so I'll spend my time refereeing. It's just like when you play, when you put enough effort and time into learning the rules as you would into your fitness. Um, anyone can do it, you just have to be really dedicated. You've just got to be a confident person, um, but you can grow that confidence just by getting involved. But I also really, really enjoy the mental challenge that refereeing brings. You're uh, making decisions that are important for the teams and the players um, while you're actually competing physically out on the field. So it's the mental and physical balance that I really, really enjoy about refereeing rugby. Everyone thinks as a referee you're the only one in the middle, you're by yourself. As soon as you step off the field you've got so much support from other referees or mentors or coaches. You get a bit of feedback on the field and you might take it a bit personally. Um, but then you just realise that they're just being just as passionate as you are and at the end of the day it's, it's just a one big community trying to work harder and I think that's what makes this game so great. Many of the Pacific Island players who still have a good element of fitness to them should take up refereeing because it's just one of those things that will keep them involved in the game and at the same time they'll grow a definite huge respect for as well.